fact that we humans, who are ourselves mere collections of fundamental particles of nature, have been able to come this close to an understanding of the laws governing us and our universe, is a great triumph. What we're looking for is how everything works and how everything is what makes everything work. Things that make the wind make the waves, and the war motion of water is like the motion of air is like the motion of sand. The fact that things have common features turns out more and more universal. But it's curiosity as to where we are, what we are. What's the pleasure in physics is that, to me, is that as it's revealed, the truth is so remarkable, so amazing. You ask me if an ordinary person, by studying hard, would get to be able to imagine these things like I imagine. Of course. I was an ordinary person who studied hard. There's no miracle, people. It just happens they got interested in this thing, and they learned all this stuff. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. When you're thinking about something you don't understand, you have a terrible, uncomfortable feeling called confusion. It's a very difficult and unhappy business. Saying that you don't understand it, meaning I don't believe it, it's too crazy, it's the kind of thing I just, I'm not going to accept. So remember to look up at the stars and not down at your feet. Try to make sense of what you see, and wonder about what makes the universe exist. I find myself trying to imagine all kinds of things all the time, and I get a kick out of it, just like a runner gets a kick out of sweating. <laughs> I get a kick out of thinking.